The Kayambaina Road is situated between the Southern Highlands and Gulf provinces. This insignificant road, when developed, will become the economic corridor for the people for these two provinces. Road, we need road. Other parts of the country, they have road to access, to market and all other things. But we don't have it. That's the problem. So people only rely on aircraft. But aircraft, airport, government no maintain them good. So all balloons had Logopura. The LNG developer ExxonMobil recently announced that the project is 90% complete. The other two proposed LNG projects are in the Gulf and Western provinces. Mr. Kapow said road infrastructure proposed to link these key provinces will significantly benefit the government, developers and the people in the long run. He added that these projects were all part of the Kokopo Umbrella Benefit Sharing Agreement and the Gobe License-based Benefit Sharing Agreement. Our heads and these uh, big companies in this country, they are also operating in that area. Now they are exporting how many thousands and millions of locks out from this area. Uh, there is no road, <coughs> good road conditions established in the province. I don't know why that happens. He urged government to be fair in distributing impact projects in the project impacted areas. The Prime Minister is soon to launch the Kayam Sembirigi Erave Road in the PDL 3 and 4 areas. Following this launch, hopes are high others will be launched as well in the other provinces. The Kayambaina Road linking the two provinces will provide easy and affordable access to basic goods and services in the nation's capital. In the meantime, he pleaded with the government to negotiate with the developers not to dismantle the Kayam and movie bridges after the pipeline construction winds down. He believes such infrastructures should be left for the people to enjoy. Bernadette Effie, National MTV News.